Good morning, Lost the West, and welcome to the November 21st edition of Eye of the Warrior. I'm Sierra Gartman. Are you looking for something to do over break? We are going to Liz and Aaron for some sneak peeks on what is in theaters now. Hey, welcome to Liz and Aaron's Entertainment Minute. I'm Aaron, and that's Liz. This week we'll be looking at what's in theaters. First up is Thor The Dark World. It's an action-adventure movie, and it takes place after the Avengers, earning a 7.7 .7 out of 10 stars. Yeah, that's pretty good. And I yeah. think it's going to be good. Next is Ender's Game. It's based on the book by Orson Scott Card, titled Ender's Game. And it follows basically the book. If you read it, then you're in for a play-by-play -play motion of the book. It follows a young boy, Ender Wigan, and his journey in battle school. And does he save the world? Go and find out. It got 7.2 stars. And coming out this Friday is Catching Fire, the sequel to The Hunger Games, and I'm pretty excited about that. Yeah, it's about the quarter call this year, and it follows Katniss and her heroism in the government and the what castle. she's going to do. So, yeah. I think I'm going to go. Thanks for watching. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, Liz and Aaron. The Warrior Hallway Police Force has been busy in the last week. Let's go to another edition of Hall Monitors. Warning, what you're about to witness contains live events and may contain graphic images. Your discretion is advised. Hall monitors is filmed on location with the men and women of Warrior Enforcements. All subjects are innocent until proven guilty by the Court of Bushmen. The school's been a lot safer now, but there's been a lot of littering going on. I've been uh, hearing about that lately for higher authorities, if you will. We'll get to it in time to it. Hey, priest! Pick that up. I'm going to pick that up. Pick it up. I don't have to. Pick it up. Pick it up. Nobody's left to pick it up, but I think this is a princey. So, for a little bit of garbage, pick it up. I'm, I'm not going to pick it up. Pick it up. No, I'll do I'm... it this one time. This is your only warning. Alright. Next time, to the slammer. <laughs> okay. Hey, sorry. Sorry. So, uh, yeah, today a fellow officer, he was uh, severely disciplined, uh, removed from active duty uh, because of following the rules a little too strictly and uh, getting. Oh, uh, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, man. He's not taking it very well. Um, you know, we, we definitely encourage students uh, picking up the trash and uh, following the school rules, but uh, you know, it's always true to remember no one's above the law, but uh, I was going to be careful on who you talk to you about that. <laughs> Make sure to obey the rules in the hallways and the commons, and remember, no one is above the law. Students at Wasa West get the opportunity every school year to learn about running a business. Let's find out about this new Tootsie-based business here at West. I'm Tia Unger, and I'm the president of the company. I am Relina Hoff, and I'm VP of Finance. Um, junior achievement, uh, well, actually, our name is, our name is Tootsie Tundra, and we are an in-school junior achievement program that's, um, it's through the class business management. So we have created and designed our own product to sell to the um, community. Um, it's a pine-sized mason jar filled with Tootsie Rolls and decorated with like a winter theme like snowflakes. Um, there are indep independent sales reps throughout the school. Um, it's just the kids in the business management class. Otherwise, you can go to room 134 or Mrs. Griza, and she can, can direct you. Um, it is going to run through the Wednesday before December 11th. On November 21st, we're having our open house in room 134, and there'll be like drinks and snacks to eat, and you can see our product. After a successful fall sports season at West, the seasons have changed, and we are now moving on to the winter sports season. Our sports team has put together some previews for the upcoming season. What are your expectations towards this winter sports season?
Our expectations in basketball this year is to battle our way up through the conference and compete for that top spot. I'm Katrina Seiler and I'm part of the Wasa West girls basketball team. This year we're hoping to head to state and win another conference championship. Thanks, sports team. Thank you for watching this edition of Eye of the Warrior. Remember to follow us on Twitter at Eye of the Warrior. For any questions or comments, please use the hashtag EOTW. Have a great day and be a warrior today.